the solutions of Jesus. But Jesus said unto them, They need not depart. Give ye them to eat. Matthew chapter 14, verse 16, King James Version. What do you do when you have a problem that you cannot solve? Do you ask God for help? Or do you tell God how He must solve your problem? Many times in our supplications to God, we tell Him how He should solve our problem. This is what happened in the story found in Matthew chapter 14, verse 13 to 21. There was a problem. It was evening and people who had come a great distance to see Jesus were hungry. The disciples told Jesus to send the people into the villages to buy food. But that was not Christ's solution. His solution was that the disciples should feed the people. How were they going to feed several thousand people? Christ's solution sounded crazy while theirs seemed to be more reasonable. Has this ever happened to you? Have you ever asked God to solve a problem, but the solution He gives you seems crazy? That is when we need to exercise faith, accept the will of God, and trust His Word. When we ask for solutions from God, we must also ask for the necessary faith to accept and trust that His solutions are better than ours. The disciples agreed to do what Jesus had told them to do. They brought to him the only food they could find, five loaves of bread and two fishes. Matthew chapter 14 verse 17. Jesus took this small amount of food from the disciples. He prayed over it, asking his father's blessing. And from that small quantity of food, Jesus miraculously feed over 5,000 hungry people. If we put what we have at God's disposal, even if it is small, He can use our little to create amazing solutions to problematic situations. Even if we think our talents are small, but give them to God, He will use them to help work out His solutions. In fact, God's solutions may often exceed our expectations. That is what happened when the disciples gave Jesus five loaves of bread and two fish. This was nothing compared with the problem at hand. Yet, all the many people ate and were satisfied, and they gathered up what was left over from the pieces, twelve baskets full. Matthew chapter 14, verse 20. Not one person left hungry, and there was much food left over to share with others. Do not tell Jesus what to do with your problem, but accept whatever solutions He has. Leave your problems in His hands. Give Him what you have and watch for His solutions. Pamela Catalan So, what do you think about this story? Comment down below and share your thoughts.